Appalachian Wireless and Samsung proudly introduce Black November. All month long, get the Samsung Galaxy S9 for just a penny, the Galaxy S9 Plus just $99.99, and the Note 9 just $249.99. Black Friday, all month long at Appalachian Wireless. Two-year agreement required. See store for details. This morning, more than 200 people gathered for a press conference held by Pikeville Medical Center, where details were announced for investing over $52 million in upcoming projects and improvements. You know, Pikeville Medical Center represents uh, and services over 450,000 patients throughout our region and to not only make investments on our main campus and to provide the needed services, but also to expand and to go out into the communities to make it more convenient for those that we serve. We wanna make certain that we're providing the best possible care, and we were able to, uh, to do that through the bricks and mortar movement that uh, we announced today. The biggest monetary project announced today was a $32 million investment to build a new heart and vascular institute with a projected completion date of August of 2020. But the announcement of a new children's hospital definitely drew the most attention. That the people of this region for years have had to send our children to Lexington, to Cincinnati, to West Virginia, and those are great hospitals. There's no denying that but the burden that it puts upon the people of this region is unreal. Phase one of that project will be the relocation and expansion of a pediatrics clinic with a completion date of March of 2019. Phases two and three will include inpatient beds and services. PMC CEO Donovan Blackburn says he is proud to be able to announce so many new projects after laying off more than 100 employees earlier this year. In February, we did a realignment of the hospital. We, we refocused our mission. Uh, we were struggling with some fi finances, and that, that's been well known. Uh, we've been able to shore all that up. We've made some good financial decisions with the board's direction. Uh, we're now operating very nicely. We're in the black. Uh, and now we're making investments to, uh, to serve the area so we can continue to grow. Pikeville Medical Center currently employs about 3,000 people, but officials say that number will grow as these projects are completed. In Pikeville, I'm Shannon Deskins, EKB News.